by orders of the Peaky <laughs> Blinders. <laughs> to my channel. I am Brian Farrell and I am so happy to have you guys all back because today's video is so exciting. I'm excited to bring you guys this video. It's something I've been wanting to do now for weeks and weeks and I'm finally able to do it. And today we're going to talk about the Peaky Blinder style. So I just binge watched the BBC crime drama show Peaky Blinders. And I absolutely love that show. I went through the first five seasons within like a week. It's a crime drama show about the 1920 gangster family, Thomas Shelby and the Shelby family, played by Killian Murphy. A war veteran who had just returned from the Great War to come back and run his family business in the mean streets of Birmingham, England. As riveting and as exciting as the show is, the one thing that stood out to me in this show was their style, what they wore in the show. So in today's video, I wanna talk about the style of the Peaky Blind. So let's boop, dive right in to it. Now in the series, the cast is wearing a three-piece tweed suit, mostly in darker colors like your navy, black, charcoal gray, brown, so we're gonna break down the suit from the three-piece suit to the accessory all the way down to the shoes. Let's first talk about the detachable collar. Now that's something you don't see in modern era suits. The reason the detachable collars were made was because the collars on the shirt would always go flat. So to prevent that from happening, they create a detachable collar that way it stays stiff and firm. Now when it comes to the dress shirt, they mainly wore white dress shirts, but they did sometimes wear pinstripe dress shirts also, and dress shirts with cufflinks. Another thing that I noticed in the show was that they wear bands around their shirt sleeve. Do you want to know why that was, why they wore bands around their arm sleeves? Well, there was a time where all the arm sleeves, the shirt sleeves, would all be the same size. So it didn't matter if you were tall or short, all sleeves came in one size. So what they would do is they would take an armband and they would just pull their sleeves up and then wrap the armband around it. That way it's not baggy down here and it's not just like falling, covering their hands because the sleeves were so long. So that's why you see armbands during that time was to bring the sleeves up make it look like the sleeves fit around their arms and it was just really long and very baggy. Now when it came to the shoes, they wore a lot of brown shoes and they were very worn in. All right, now let's talk about accessories, what they wore with the suit. They all wore pocket watches, which was a really normal thing at that time. And when it comes to ties, Thomas Shelby always rocked the skinny tie, but Arthur Shelby wore the bow tie. Now, you wouldn't be a picky blinder if you didn't have the messenger hat or the newsboy hat. That right there was a staple of what the picky blinders was, was the messenger hat that they had on. And what they did was they would put a blade, they would stick the blade right at the brim of the hat and they would use it as a way to take their hat off and then slice their opponent's face whenever they got into like a confrontation or they were about to get into a fight. They would use that to blind their opponent, which is why they were known as the Peaky Blinders. But you did sometimes see people wear fedoras in the show also. For the very 1920 gangster look, the fedora. All right, so the suit that I'm wearing is a tweed suit. I couldn't find a tweed suit in the store because all the stores were closed due to COVID-19. So I had to go online and find a tweed suit. And this is what I found online. And I really like it, it actually fits really good. Um, it's a little thick, so it's not something I would want to wear during the summertime, but during the fall or winter time, I would definitely get a lot of wear out of this. It is a little thick, so and it's too hot right now to be wearing this during the summertime. I'm also wearing a black tie. Nothing really significant about this tie. It's just a regular black tie. I'm also wearing a white dress shirt that I got from, um, I don't remember where I got this shirt from. 
So I've got a lot of white shirts in different places. But I'm wearing a white dress shirt. I'm also wearing a pocket watch, which I just got off Amazon. Just bought a cheap pocket watch. I'm not a pocket watch expert, nor do I wear a pocket watch. So I didn't think to buy an expensive one. Just bought a nice cheap one off Amazon. And instead of rocking the newsboy or the messenger hat, I decided to rock the fedora because the fedora fits better on my head than a newsboy hat because of my hair. It's hard for me to find a newsboy hat that fits my head correctly. So I decided to go with a fedora instead of the newsboy hat. And as far as shoes, I just wore my Stacey Adams Cognac Chelsea boots. Complete the whole look. Alright, now I got a little small lookbook for you guys. So check out this lookbook. I hope you guys like it and I will see you at the end of the video. Check this video out. about wraps up today's video i hope you guys enjoy that please hit the subscribe button if you haven't already hit that notification bell like this video if you liked it and also comment down below and tell me if you like my suit the suit that i wore and if you are a fan of the peaky blinders tv series you can also catch me on my instagram page where i continue to post all the suits and outfits that i wear throughout the day you can also go to my website, www.kingstaylor.com. I haven't really been posting a lot of stuff on there lately, um, but I am going to go back to kind of posting things at least once a week or maybe two or three times a month. So I'm going to try and stay consistent and post some stuff on there. I'm going to be talking a little bit more about the show Peaky Blinders and their style on my website www.kingstaylor.com so if you want more information more in-depth information about the show and about their style go to www.kingstaylor.com and read all about it and that about does it hope you guys enjoyed today's video and i will see you in the next one peace